I guess the first <coughs> point I want to make is that you don't have kind of many digital identities, um, or at least you know in the next couple of years you won't because they will be linked together into just one digital identity that you can't really get away from in the modern world. You know you have to have these services. Um, so then what we did as researchers from uh, from psychology, um, we said, okay, what are these? What does this digital identity say about me as a person? Say about you as a person? Um, so I set. Um, a, uh, a whole load of questionnaires online. Uh, this is a personality questionnaire. There was also an IQ questionnaire, happiness questionnaire, things like that. And we got people to fill in those questionnaires um, and then share with us their Facebook data. Um, and that meant we could then publish this study showing that once you've got someone's Facebook likes, so just their Facebook likes, avoiding all of the other information on Facebook, never mind the other information around the web, um, you can predict with someone's Facebook likes, someone's personality, someone's intelligence, someone's happiness, someone's political views, someone's religious views, um, their use of language. So on the left, extrovert, talk about partying and baby and girls and amazing and nights out and things like that. And introverts talking about uh, anime and the internet and Pokemon <laughs> and, uh, and manga. Um, and some other things as well, age, gender, ethnic origin, sexual orientation, whether you're in a relationship or not whether your parents were in a relationship when you were growing up, um, the things you study and uh, things about your friendship network. Um, so how accurate are we with those? So I can give you some stats, <coughs> which is that if we've got a male and a female and their likes, we can 93% uh, of the time say which is which accurately. Um, if we've got an African-American, we've got a Caucasian-American, 95% of the time we can say which is which. Um, perhaps a better way to put it is this, which is how well does the computer know you compared to the real people who know you? Okay, so on the x, x axis is the number of likes we use to make a prediction about someone's personality. On the y axis is uh, the accuracy of our prediction of their personality. So what you can see is you need about nine likes over there on the left um, before the algorithm is as accurate as a work colleague at predicting your personality. We need about 65 likes um, before we're as accurate as a cohabitant. Um, about 60, uh, yeah, 65 uh, as, as a friend. Um, the average human accuracy is about 0.49, so that's about 95 likes. Um, your family member is about 125 likes. Um, and then our computer expected accuracy, which is the average number of likes that people actually have. So that's about 20, 225. Um, so that is almost as accurate as your spouse at predicting your personality. So a computer knows you as well as your wife, near enough. 